Our next step after publishing those records to DNS and doing a test to make sure that everything's working the way that we want would be to log into the Exchange Admin Center and enable DKIM signing for your messages. Doing that is really simple. To get there, you would log into the Microsoft Admin Portal at admin.microsoft.com. We need to log in as uh, an Exchange Administrator or Global Administrator. We'll go to Exchange. That's going to open the Exchange Admin Center. And then from here, we go to Protection, DKIM, and for the domains that we want to enable it, we select the option to enable right here. Uh, in this case, the, it's already enabled for this domain, but for each of the domains in our tenant, we would want to enable DKIM signing once we've created the records and published them and tested them and made sure everything is, is uh, in place and we're happy with it.